did Finch and Stinger tell you she was breaking up with you when she called you? No. So how did you know it was over? I didn't know it was over. We just stopped talking. <laughs> Without any explanation? Well, when she told me that, I, I, like I said, I thought it implied she was cooperating with the FBI. And, and she had told me before that that they had already had come to her and she was telling me that she was being pressured by her attorney, um, Henry Baskin, not her attorney that was representing her in the case. Yes, that you need to put distance between you and this guy. You need to not talk to him anymore. Let's try to get you cleared and what have you. So I took it that that's what she was saying. Were you aware that Fox 2 News personnel I believe towards the last year or two that she was working at Fox 2, told her they were aware of the relationship and asked her about it because they were surveilling you and she was caught. Actually, at this restaurant, where we're eating Jerusalem Pizza, <laughs> which is a kosher restaurant, by the way, um, and where you've eaten often. Um, did, she, did she tell you that she was approached by Fox 2 personnel? Yes. And what did she say she told them? Yes, I'm in a relationship with him, or I know him. He's a good guy. You know, and again, that's why, I mean, everyone who talked to her, from what she told me, she says that she would say, no, he's not. He's a good guy. Uh, you know, um, he's doing good things and so on and so forth. So, again, that, that's what she told me. She never, ever alluded or never said, and to my knowledge, to anyone about He's making me do this. He's mean. He, you know, he's a bad guy or any of those things. She stayed with you for five years of her own volition. Yes. Did she ever tell you she was going to be give you any advance warning? She was going to be doing these interviews with Diana Lewis? No. Carmen Harlan? Um, I guess that's all the questions I have. Thank you very much for doing the interview. Oh, one last thing. So you are going to be reporting in January for a very long time in federal prison because you said you won't be cooperating in the FBI. What is it like to know that you are going to lose your freedom for a number of years, and how are you preparing for that? What, what does somebody do with their last, essentially, month before they go? What, what are you doing? Um, would you, what I'm doing is you try to find out everything about the making a transition to something like that. I've never been to prison before or anything so I'm trying to find as much information out as possible you know where would I go how would it be what are my duties what are my responsibilities what's the guidelines what governs it you know again it's a fact finding information um, process at least that I've been doing to try to understand what is that what do I have to do and how do I operate within that system? Okay. Thank you very, very You're much. Welcome. I really appreciate it. <laughs>